guys, welcome to the video. My name is Amanda, I'm a third year vet student and we are officially going to pick up our golden retriever puppy. We have about a four hour drive before we go pick him up, so I'm gonna throw it back to past Amanda to the day that we found out we were getting him. Guys, it is November 7th. We just got an email from the breeder and the mom is officially pregnant. They took her to the vet today and they saw puppies. So she is officially pregnant. The due date is set for November 24th right now. So around that time in basically like two and a half weeks, we will know if we're officially getting a puppy. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Ah! It's been like over what has it been over a year and a half now that we've been on the wait list oh my god it's actually happening i can't believe it well i'll update you guys when we hear more it's november 24th i just finished my classes for the day and no puppy updates yet but fingers crossed we get some good news soon <sighs> oh my god so today has been an absolute roller coaster um it's the 25th and the due date for the puppies was yesterday so I've literally been checking my email basically every 20 minutes to see if there's any updates and we finally got an email saying that there was eight puppies which so exciting however there was only one boy so we were set on having a boy I really don't have a good reason for it I just, I just always pictured myself with a little boy puppy so we had told the breeder that we wanted a boy because there was only one boy in the litter and we were fourth on the waiting list, he was actually going to someone else. So even though they had puppies, I did not think that we were going to get a puppy this litter. I sent her an email back just saying that we'll wait till next litter if that means we'll get a boy. And basically five minutes later, I got an email back saying that the girl who was originally supposed to get the boy couldn't take a puppy anymore. So he was ours if we wanted him. So now we're getting a puppy. Oh my God. I have literally felt every single emotion in the past little bit. One, I was so excited that they had puppies. Then I was sad that we weren't getting a puppy. And now I'm like over the moon that we are getting a puppy. I honestly, I can't believe it's happening. We are literally getting a puppy. We are gonna have a puppy in this place in two months. Oh my God. I feel like I could cry right now. I'm so excited. But anyway, I just wanted to let you guys know that he is officially born. We officially have a puppy, a little boy. I can't believe that just happened. Oh my God. We're getting a puppy. <laughs> officially have a puppy he is so cute i am literally obsessed he's been so good we're about halfway home and he's honestly slept the whole trip so far he just woke up we're gonna get gas and let him out to pee and then hopefully he'll sleep for the rest of the way but i'm literally obsessed with him i'm gonna show you guys hi what's up are you the cutest ever yeah Look, we just woke up from a nap. Oh, there's a big yawn. I'm obsessed. I am so in love with him. I can't stop. Oh. That was adorable. Since I haven't given you guys a proper introduction, meet Link. Say hi. Nice to meet you guys. <laughs> Hey guys, I thought I would pop on here and give you a little bit of an update now that we've had Link home for about 24 hours. Honestly, the whole drive home, he was such an angel. He slept for like 
three out of the four hour drive that we had. So already off to like an amazing start. I'm not gonna lie, the first night home was a little bit rough. He woke up every single hour that night. He was definitely a little bit stressed being away from his sisters and being away from home. But since then he is settling in so nicely. He is the sweetest boy. He has honestly been so easy. The potty training is going really well. The crate training is going really well. Overall, he's just like the cutest little fluff ball. He literally looks like a teddy bear. I am obsessed with him. Like, I don't know how I'm gonna get any schoolwork done because I just stare at him all day. But hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing the videos of us picking him up and some of the clips that I threw in from our first couple days at home. I did also just want to sit down and explain why we decided to get a dog now, how we ended up getting Link specifically, just in case anyone had any questions about it. So basically, I knew that I wanted a dog at some point during vet school. I grew up with a family dog and unfortunately we had to put her down in my third year of undergrad. At that point, I obviously didn't know what was going to happen if I was going to get into vet school or what my life was going to look like for the next couple years. So getting a puppy at that point was definitely not a possibility. And then when I got into vet school, I wanted to make sure that I had a good grasp on how to study as a vet student. I wanted to make sure that I could handle taking on a puppy and all the responsibility that comes with that while also still being able to stay on top of school and manage everything that comes with being a vet student. After finishing up my first year, I knew that I would be able to handle a puppy and be able to balance that with vet school. So that's when my boyfriend and I sat down and decided to get a puppy. And that's basically the start of the story for Link. Now I do want to say that even though we went through a breeder for our first puppy, I am a huge supporter and a huge believer in the adopt or shop responsibly movement. There are so many incredible breeders out there and also so many incredible rescues that as long as you are doing your research and you are finding reputable organizations or reputable breeders, there's nothing wrong with either option and just because we went through a breeder for our first dog it doesn't mean that we'll never adopt in the future and vice versa even if we adopted this time it wouldn't mean that I wouldn't go through a breeder in the future so that's kind of my thoughts on that but if you have any more questions I'm happy to answer them down below. As you guys would have saw we found out in September that we were going to be getting a little puppy and I am so excited to share the journey of him growing up here on my channel. I'm sure there are going to be many ups and downs, but I'm gonna put it all on camera for you so that you can see what it's like having a puppy as a vet student. I hope you guys love him as much as I do, and I am so excited to share this little addition of the family with you. Anyways, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys are so excited to meet Mr. Link, and I will see you guys in next week's video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe.